How's it going everybody? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. I hope you're all having a beautiful day. So today we're going to do something that I've never done before and I don't think anybody has really ever done before. Now before we jump into it, I need to explain. So we have in Brawlhalla epic skins and then we have epic crossovers. In this video, we are going to focus just on the epic skins. Those skins are... Mad Genius Scarlet. This was the very first epic skin that ever came out. And they called it an epic skin because it has animated weapons. That's what made it epic, okay? And then they came out with several other epic skins that we're gonna play in this video. I'm gonna play one match with every single epic skin starting with Mad Genius Scarlet. So without trying to make this video super, super long, let's just go ahead and get right into it. Now, I didn't tell you the other epic skins to see if you guys can guess. So if you're watching this in the live premiere, let me know. Can you guess the other epic skins? Or even better, which epic skin will I play next? All right, we're going against a... Oh my gosh, I forgot her name. <laughs> I forgot the name. Onyx, we're going against Onyx. Oh yeah, my Scarlet skills might not be as good as Schwerpy, but they're good enough, baby. Woo! Boom! Oh yeah, get that out of here, Onyx. Oops. Oh wow, that was actually a really good side air he did there. What? This cannon guy is incredible! But Scarlet has so much strength. What a throw. Oh, get down there, Onyx. No, re no recovering back from that. Hammer spike straight into the abyss. Ooh, I tried to down air, but it didn't catch that recovery. All right, we got a little bit of damage on him. That's all we needed. Let's keep this advantage going. Oh yeah, dodge up again. So I can hit you with that neutral sig. Oh. I feel like Lance is a pretty decent uh, cannon counter. Like, oh, he spot dodged that time. Oh, spike straight down again. I really do hope that they make more epic skins because I really do like them. I mean, they've done more epic crossovers than epic skins. There's way more epic crossovers. And the epic crossovers are epic. I mean, a lot of them do have animated skins kind of, but... Oh, man. My hammer is really not the best against gauntlets. Oh, my gosh! I threw the hammer down! And it did not block that recovery, how? That's okay, we still have the damage The damage lead, it's still ours. Okay, don't know what that was. Here we go, here we go. Get down! Another spike right down in the same spot. All three stocks. GG, dude. GG. So that was a pretty quick game. That was perfect. At this rate, we'll be easily able to do all the epic skins. So the next one that came out was... Apocalypse Mirage. Where is it? Apocalypse Mirage was the second epic skin that they came out with. Now, in this one, I'm going to do a different color. How about we do something different... I do have black, but I feel like everybody uses black. Hmm. Oh, should we do haunting? That looks really, really good. I think we're going to do haunting. I don't really need to change up the stats. I think I'll just go base. If you guys enjoy this kind of content, please drop a like on this video. It really helps me out. So I didn't mention this yet, but there's actually a total of six, six epic skins. And three of them you can get any time. And then the other three, this guy has honor, respect. The other three you can't get anymore, so... Maybe with that knowledge, you can maybe guess what the skins are. Yeah. 
There we go. Decent edge guarding. Oh my goodness. Whenever you're going against Katars, you have to be really careful. Oops. I didn't mean to throw away the spear. Or I mean the scythe. I actually wanted to use it. Oh well. So many down lights. Uh oh. How do I keep getting a spear, man? I need to... Oh, I wish I would have hit that. Okay, Lucian, you're gonna go bye-bye. Oh, we didn't hit him. Oh my goodness, that side sig. And there's the disconnect. Feels bad. I didn't even really get to use the side. Look how beautiful it looks, though. This is arguably one of the best-looking epic skins you can buy. I think he's dead. Nope. It's just a bot, but... Down! <laughs> that was Apocalypse Mirage. GG, dude, GG. Sorry that you rage quit there. But yeah, that's one of the best looking ones. Uh, the next epic skin... You guys probably know this one. Shin Sakai Koji. That's right. Pay no attention to uh, Minecraft Steve. Alright, Shin Sakai Koji, a lot of people think this is the best looking skin in Brawlhalla. Like, of all time. Of all skins. Is that what you guys think? Let me know in the chat. I honestly want to know. Verdant Bloom looks so good. Actually, all the colors look good on this skin. That's pretty much one of the reasons why it looks so good. Like, the skin looks amazing no matter what. We're going to go Frozen Forest. Alright, got our next match. Going against another Onyx. Let me know if you have any of these epic skins in your inventory. I would like to know. Which epic skin is the most owned epic skin? I don't really know. There's no way to really keep track of that. But if you comment down below which epic skin you have or skins, we might be able to figure out which one is the most popular. Switching back and forth between these legends does take me a second to get used to which legend I'm playing again, but it seems like we're doing great, actually. I'll let him get that weapon. Koji has really, really fun signatures. I really li have always liked Koji. Just a fun legend. He has really cool looking uh, signatures, and I didn't mention this yet, but you probably already noticed. Epic skins don't just have epic weapons that are animated. They also have signatures that look different. Like, you can notice my signatures are a little bit different when I'm using Shinsekai Koji. Look at that. And that's true of all the epic skins, mostly. Uh, Scarlet and... Scarlet and... Uh, oh, what is her name? Mirage, yeah. <laughs> Scarlet and Mirage don't have the, the cool animated signatures, like Koji, but... You know, that's another reason why Koji is just one of the best animated epic skins. We're not going to get hit by that. Get that out of here. Oh man, if he would have done a recovery, I would have been dead. Yep, there it is. Sometimes I don't go for the weapons just for that reason. It becomes too obvious and then like they just get you punished right there. Got him with that down air snipe. I'm not sure which I like better, the bow or the sword. Ooh, I love the, the aggression. A little bit too much can backfire though. Threw away the weapon. This guy really wants to beat me with the gauntlets. Oh, that spot dodge. Nice, nice, nice. All right, final stocks. Going against Citizen. Wow. Do you see how fast he turned around and did that neutral light? I don't even need to use signatures. I could just kill him with light attacks, but we'll see how it goes. I might have to kill him with light attacks at this rate. GG, not yet, not yet. 
Oh, so close. There it is. GG, dude. GG. We're not going to let him get back on stage, you know? Well played, though, Onyx. Thank you for playing until the end of the match. <laughs> that gives you honor and respect right there. All right, guys. Now we're going into the epic skins that are not crossovers, but they're not ones that you can purchase. These are the epic skins that you got if you completed the final tier of each battle pass. We're talking Akuma no Koga Hattori. And I'm not going to say the rest, but you guys might already know them. We're going to go esports colors on this one. This is a skin that you cannot get anymore. So it was. It, this is the epic skin from the very first battle pass. You had to get level 85 and have the premium battle pass to get this skin. So this is an epic skin that is arguably one of the most rare epic skins in the game, if not the rarest epic skin. And I gotta say, it's an amazing looking skin. Look at the sword. Look at the spear when you see it. They're just so good looking. Also, these epic skins, the battle pass ones, they do have amazing looking signature graphics. Every now and then, a hard ground pound just throws them off. Oh, there was the perfect read on the gauntlet recovery. Check out the spear. Look at the flames. I mean, they did such a good job with these weapons. Oh, we got him. Look at how cool those signatures look. He is trying really hard to get us with those side airs. Oh! We made him miss because he didn't want to get hit by the ground pound. That was a really good play. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ooh, I thought he was going to kick me into my own mind. That would have been very humiliating. I'll take the, uh, the, the roundhouse kick any day. Love these signatures too, they look so good! See, he learned! He's a diamond player for sure! He's not gonna let me hit that same move twice. Oh man, the, we the weapon change into the downlight, he knew exactly what he was doing. That was a really good play. Alright, let's avoid the reverse three stock, right? GG, GG, that spear, that flaming spear right to the face. GG though, you gotta give him respect for that comeback. Much respect. Alright, the next epic skin, guys. Probably the most popular one. Retro Reaper Nyx. This is from the last battle pass, or I should say the second battle pass. The last battle pass now is, uh, is actually in the books. Um, let's go Gala Colors. This one looks really good. I guess I'm going Strengths. Strength stance on this one. Strength is such a hard word for me to say. I don't know why. <sighs> All right, we got our next match. Oof, nine strength Taros. So by the way, some of you guys might be thinking, man, Lucian, he only posts his wins. Actually, that's that's not true at all. These, these games are literally back to back to back. I'm not taking like any breaks or cuts. I mean, I only cut out the waiting time just to make the video better, but like, I don't... I don't skip any any matches, so if I lose, I, I lose, and I will post that. He got a little bit greedy there on that Taros neutral sig, but I mean, when you're playing Taros, I feel like you pretty much gotta go for that.
Axe is a really good scythe counter usually, so I'm trying to use this uh, platform to my advantage and just like not let him hit me so easily. He is just playing lights out with this unarmed. Yo. Get down there. What are you trying to do that side sig on me? Oh, that, that side air on the hammer, man. If you're in deep red, that's definitely death. Oh, now he's getting the spacing down. But Taros? Taros is a little bit too slow to, to mess with this site. Oh, he went for the down air and just couldn't get back. GG, dude, GG. Well played, man. I love the, uh, the colors on that Mecha Taros. That's a beautiful look. All right, guys, last but not least, the final epic skin. You already know what it is, Aurora Brynn. This is literally my favorite epic skin just because it's on Brynn. So we're going to go Gold Forge to Aurora Brynn. So far I've been able to win with every single epic skin. Now I have a lot of pressure to win with Aurora Brynn so I can complete it. Oh man. Oh yeah, here we go. I'm not going to lie, when I saw that they made an epic skin for Brynn, like I was happy, but I also felt bad because Brynn already has a meta dev. Like, that's another type of rare skin, meta devs. And uh, now she has an epic skin and a meta dev. Like, man, BMG must really love Brynn or something. First time playing with the axe today. What a side air. Oh my goodness. This Scarlet definitely knows how to play Lance. We gotta be careful. I think that Spear is gonna do me better for countering this Lance. There we go, we knocked that lance out of her hand. Get out of here, Scarlet. Oh my goodness, she is really good. I hope she's worse with the hammer because she was really good with the spear. Oh my goodness, I thought I would hit with that for sure. So far my spear uh, recoveries have been hitting the most. Get out of here with that. Oh, finisher with a spike ball. Let's go. Look at the signatures on Aurora Brynn too. They just look so beautiful. So this was the epic skin you got with the most recent battle pass, the Jotun battle pass. Wow, what a side sig. I might be dead here. Nope. Miraculously, we live. Any little bit of damage is damage. Oh, how did I not throw that straight down? 
Man, I thought I threw that straight down. All right, here we go, guys. Oh! GG, she, act she actually kind of killed herself there, but I'll take it. That means we won with every single epic skin! Straight up, like back to back to back, six wins in a row, six epic skins. No oh man, that was that was better than I could have planned. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, drop a huge like and again, comment to me uh, down below which epic skins you own. I'm interested. And uh, as always, guys, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.